Hey everybody, thanks for checking out this video on my channel. It's been forever since I've made a video for myself and this one truthfully is not. This is taking care of some business for the uh, store I run, Phil's Comic Shop. We uh, recently raffled off a JLA Avengers with 100% of the ticket sales being donated to the Hero Initiative. Uh, a couple things go over here. We got uh, two surprises and, uh, you know, just little some of my personal opinions. Um, first surprise is we weren't actually raffling one book. We were raffling three copies. So we will not have one winner. We will have three winners. And we're going to do the drawing here in a second to see who they are. Um, second surprise is uh, I decided to match whatever we raised in ticket sales. So uh, we ended up having 159 tickets sold at a dollar piece. It's $159 plus my $159 equals $318, which we just sent to the Hero Initiative. So I want to say thank you to everyone who bought a ticket or tickets. Um, don't want to diminish that at all but honestly I'm a little disappointed we didn't raise more money than this even though it was only um, projected to be one copy being auctioned we basically are going to be giving away three for at or less what one copy could have sold for by itself so that being said the Hero Initiative never shuts down you can donate to them anytime um, if you participated in this or you didn't participate in this and you'd like to donate to them you can when this uh, goes live on my uh, YouTube page, I will have their information in the description. may not be there immediately because I'm doing this from my phone for reasons I don't want to get into, but once I get home into my desktop, I will edit the uh, description to include the Hero Initiative information and links for people who want to consider making an additional donation, especially the people who win. Um, I think the most tickets we sold to any one person was $30. Um, some people just bought one, some people bought, you know, many, but, uh, we had 25 unique people with 159 total tickets sold. So, um, yeah, we're going to do this here in a second. Just close this PayPal out. And pull up the randomizer here. Okay, so there is one rule. Because there are, we're giving away three, and I didn't initially say that, the same person's not going to be able to win more than once. So if your name comes up a second time, don't be upset. I'm giving it to somebody else. We're going to have three unique winners. Uh, that's just the way it's going to be. I hope everybody can get behind that and understand that. This was for charity, and we wanted everybody to have a chance to get this cool book at a reasonable price. They're selling... Anywhere between $120 and $195 during the past 45 days. So either way, someone's going to get a good deal on these. And hopefully they will enjoy them. And at the same time, we got to help out a, a good charity and do it. And honor the memory of George Perez, who was a contributor, main contributor to this project. So, uh, all right, here we go. Pull up the randomizer. show here we're starting a new tab the way we're going to do this since we're auctioning three books we are going to randomize three times for each book being donated so the third randomization will be the first winner as long as there's no duplications the sixth randomization will be the second winner and the ninth randomization will be the third winner The only exception to that would be if, you know, the sixth randomization came up the same as the third. All right, so we see here we have a clean slate. Going to populate with everybody who is in here. Yeah, we have the ticket numbers. Whoops, a little too far there. Ticket numbers next to the names. I lied. We had 26 unique entrants. I thought there were 25. So, 26 people, each with three chances to win one of these. So, we 
we have Christian down to Cario, Cario to Christian. All right, so we have everybody. We have zero randomizations, so we're going three times right now with the third one being our first winner. So here's one. Here is two. All right, and this will be for our first winner. Three. Our first winner is Scott K. Scott bought a decent amount of tickets, so I'm happy to see him get one of these. And he'll be in tomorrow for New Comic Day, so that'll be waiting for him. That'll be a nice surprise for Scott. All right. So now we have three randomizations for our first winner. We are going to do this three more times. So on the sixth one, we will have our second winner as long as it's not Scott again. So there's one. Two. And three, this will be our second winner as long as it's not Scott. Which, of course, it is. <laughs> All right, so we're going to have to do this a seventh time to find a unique winner. Seven. William Steele. He's another subscriber. All right, so Will, number two goes to you. So now instead of the ninth, it's going to be the tenth randomization that will be our third winner because we had to do an extra one here. So we have had seven. We're going to do this three more times. There's one, two, and three. And our final winner, as long as it is not Scott or Will, is Scott again. So we have to do it in the 11th time looking for someone other than Scott or Will. So we see you are at 10, going to 11. All right, Jose Rascon, who is a third subscriber. So we have our three winners, Jose Rascon, William Steele, and Scott K. Uh, again, I appreciate everybody who took part in this and the money you helped us raise. And we uh, hope to see you in the store soon. Like I said, I'll have information in the description once I get to my desktop. If you wish to make additional donations or if you didn't before and you're seeing this, you can donate to Hero Initiative anytime. It's a great cause. And I thank you again for checking out my channel. I actually have a uh, package sitting at home that's a personal grail that if I have time, I will try to make a video for just because I haven't done anything of my own content in a very long time. Uh, just to give you guys something to look at. I'll see if I can get that done when I get out of here. It's already almost three in the morning on the eastern seaboard. We'll see if we can make that happen. Have a great day, everybody. Peace.